Medina Spirit. Bob Baffert juices up another horse and gets a win for the Derby. Back to back derbies for, Vela for uh, Johnny Velasquez and Bob Baffert as a combo. It hasn't happened in years. Um, Ron Turcotte, I think, the last time did that. Um, getting the win with Secretariat. They won back to back 72 73. Medina Spirit gets the win, took the lead coming out of the gate. Opened up the opening half in 46 seconds. That was fast enough. That's what I think that they needed to do to be able to get the win. It wasn't necessarily sure that he was going to be able to get that win, but Medina Spirit got the lead, was able to hold off the rest of the horses, and when it came down to it, he was able to lead to to, uh, to uh, leave the rest of them in the pack. Um, Helium was in there. I thought he was a bit close to the, to the pace. Wasn't Didn't have enough gas left coming out of it. Um, soup and Sandwich was near the front as well. He didn't have enough gas coming out of it, so as they closed in, Medina Spear was able to pull away. Um, essential Quality ran a good race, just didn't run good enough. He chased him down, but he was only able to get fourth. Second place, we had Mandaloon, Florent Duro. Uh, Mandaloon, big horse. I was kind of afraid of that happening. He had good workout time. Mandaloon ran a good race as well. Could not get it done either. Third place was the nine, Hot Rod Charlie. Um, Flavian Pratt in there, Hot Rod Charlie, another impressive horse, was able to get third place in essential quality running fourth. So there we have it. Three undefeated horses go down. I've got to watch this race again. I'm not sure what happened to a lot of those horses. Rock your world. Um, not sure what happened to um, um, Burbonic. Not sure what happened to... Um, um, who was the other one I was looking at there? Um, known Agenda. So going to have to rewatch this, uh, re this one definitely, of course, to see what happened down the stretch. However, Medina Spirit gets the win. Bob Baffert. Johnny Velasquez with another win, unbelievable. Um, decent odds on him to um, seven once again, second. The um, Mandaloon, third, Hot Rod Charlie, fourth essential quality. Um, final time was a 201 and two, I think it was. Uh, so a good time, legitimate time out of this horse. Um, probably, I know we're gonna see him back for the Preakness as well. Don't necessarily know how well he's going to do. I uh, don't know who's necessarily going to be back for the Preakness because a lot of people will pull their horses out and wait for the Belmont. But Medina Spear gets the upset win. Bob Baffert does it again, along with Johnny V.